Summer school is offering a lot of lessons about what education might look like this fall. Much of the concern about going back to school is centered on kids being kids, which in other words means unpredictable. But as our Paula Tutman shows us so far, schools are finding the real wild card is often parents. So we think about this experiment called summer school. It gives us information on what in-person learning might look like in the fall. One thing that has come up, however, is the importance of the parental response. The plan is for Novi schools to have in-person learning this fall using its current summer school model as a dress rehearsal. One thing that is clear is while students thus far are amenable to the changes it will take to keep them safe, a bigger problem is emerging that could throw a kink in the safe protocols. And that's some parents. I received an email from a, a parent that said, I'm gonna contact my lawyer and see what legal options I have to prevent you from forcing my kid to wear a mask. And and, he, and this parent said the science is not uh, good on mask wearing. Masks will be mandatory just to even enter the building, period. I think the science is pretty good about mask wearing. And, and, uh, and so it, it concerns me that there are members of our community that are so adamant that a simple precaution like a mask, like I have, is, is not something that they want to uh, wear. And students who take this virus seriously are alarmed. It's been over politicized and it's really costing us big time. By people actively choosing to not wear masks and not do social distancing, they're affecting me. Even though it is something mundane like that, but it still sucks when you miss out on those life milestones and experiences. And it's because of some parents that some students themselves become the gaping hole in the chain link fence of safety precautions against COVID for in-person learning. They're engaging in activities that are problematic and that student will then come to our school and, and potentially be around other students who have been safe, but now this one student could be a spreader of the virus. We're trying to walk a tightrope between uh, ensuring that, that we don't spread the virus, but also ensuring that students are in, a, in an environment where they can thrive. If I have one message to parents, I would say, uh, start having your kids wear masks at home so they feel comfortable wearing masks. Uh, engage in the science, uh, you know, and, and take as many uh, precautionary measures as you can to make sure that when your children come to our schools in the fall, that you've done everything you can to make them safe. Paula Tutman, Local 4.